Cameras today are more capable than ever. Scene modes, guide modes, auto ISO, active delighting, group area autofocus, highlight weighted metering, and buttons and menus and more buttons. Firmware updates can even make your camera more capable. You've got cameras and phones that can capture a burst of images and even help you pick the best one. Yes, there is a lot of technology involved, but at the end of the day, there are three key things that your camera isn't telling you. Now, since your camera isn't telling you these things, how do I know them? Well, my camera talks to me, but only on the condition that she talks to me here in headquarters and she insists that it be in a video. Now, she doesn't always talk, so let's be real quiet and see if she has anything to say. Hey there, little camera. Do you have anything to say to us today? Why, yes, hello. I do have some things to talk about today. Okay, trusty camera. Do you have anything to tell us today? Yes, your lighting is terrible. Hm. Oh, really? I think you're being a little short with me today. But let's think about that. I think she's right in a way. While the camera's meter will help us get the right exposure, it's not going to tell us the difference between this and this. In fact, let's go back to the harsh lighting. Maybe you're looking for some high contrast black and white. So that's what may be called for. It's important to remember, even with all of the technology in my state-of-the-art full-frame camera, it's your judgment, not the camera, that is the most important part. Okay, so what else do you have to say today? Your location is terrible. I hate it here. Rude camera. Hmm. I do preach a little bit about location. Let's think about that. Well, we've all seen a shot like this. So when I think about location, I love places like the Grand Canyon and even more exotic locales or even city streets. But when I think about location, I keep myself in the present and I try to remember just to change things a little bit so that I can turn this into something more like this. Okay, camera, since you're feeling a little bit rude today, do you have just one more thing you wanna say? Your timing, it sucks. I've had just about enough of your attitude. Timing? Eh. Well, one thing I've learned, especially when it comes to getting dramatic colors, if you want that sunrise, you've got to get up pretty early in the morning to make sure you're where you want to be when the sun is making those crimson, pink, and gold colors that many of us crave. Similarly, if you want those evening colors at the beach, a few more minutes outside instead of at the beachside bar can really pay off. Okay, you fussy little camera you can go back to your shelf now. I will say this, our rude little camera today mentioned three very big things that you control, timing, light, and location. All of the amazing computer and imaging technology in your camera won't make those three elements come together for you. You've got to control those and your little camera, it'll help you do the rest.